in this tutorial, we will make a parametric component to our facade as a tent shading panel or structure. Let's start. Go to family. Create new family. And then go to metric. Select metric generic. model pattern base open <coughs> okay first uh, go to units change the unit to meters two decimal places okay okay select the grid let's change the grid to 2 meters by 2 meters ok next we select the scale scale to 1 is to 20 ok next we create a reference point select draw on work plane then set work plane set work plane then draw reference point then click set set work plane pick reference point then set work plane set work plane then pick reference point set work plane set then pick reference point cancel <coughs> select all go to filter check none select reference point ok then go to offset Pick the button, we create new parameter, and type height, ok, ok, go to family types, let's change the height value to 1 meter, apply, ok, Next, um, select the two reference point, <coughs> spline through points, then check reference line. Okay, select the two reference point, spline through points. check reference line ok next select reference point then select draw on face pick at midpoint pick at midpoint pick at midpoint Pick at midpoint. Okay. Pick at midpoint and let's rotate so we see it clearly. Close. Then pick at midpoint. <coughs> okay. Next, select reference point. The two reference point then spline through points check reference line ok select reference point and one on the other side spline through points then reference line ok 
reference point peak reference point at midpoint and at midpoint okay select the two reference point then spline through points check reference line okay next select the two reference point spline through points check reference line next select reference point and one reference point here spline through points check reference line okay same thing on the other side select reference point select spline to through points check reference line okay next select reference point pick reference point then select go to normalize curve parameter select the button we create new parameter type ncp1 okay okay next select reference point pick reference point at the vertical reference line pick then select that reference point then normalize your parameter select the button let's create new parameter now type ncp2 okay okay next uh, reference point you need two reference point on both side okay select the two reference point or okay select the two go to normalize curve parameter create new parameter then type ncp3 okay okay let's go to family types let's change the value so you can change it to 0.5 or 0.6 okay good let's ncp1 let's say 0.6 okay ncp2 let's say 0.9 okay next let's draw a spline through points pick at this point second point here and the third point here cancel the command select the spline make it reference line okay then select reference point these two reference point spline through points uh, check reference line okay select um, let's draw a spline through points pick pick here and pick here cancel the command select this line make it a reference line okay let's rotate the view okay next select these two reference point spline through points then check reference line next spline through points pick reference point 2 
and third reference point cancel select spline make it reference line okay now we select the three reference line one two and three then create a form select surface okay let's rotate the view let's do it on the other side select reference line select then select create a form select surface okay let's rotate let's see okay good now let's try to flex the component let's change the ncp1 2.4 okay good ncp2 let's change it to 0.8 okay good ncp3 let's change it to point four okay okay let's see perfect okay okay now we have the tent uh, structure or uh, tent panel let's save it let's type tent shade panel save it to the desktop load into project and close okay let's load it into the project okay Okay, let's go to 3D. Okay, let's turn on the mass, show mass. Okay, let's go back, select the mass, edit in place. Okay, select the, the surface. Let's go back, change it to no pattern okay so you have only the surface so no pattern okay okay so we have only the surface let's look at in the perspective now we apply the the pattern select the surface go to pattern and select Ten shade panel. Okay. Okay. Now let adjust the parameter. Select the panel, the surface. Then go to family types. Select the height to point five. Apply. Okay. Let's change some of the setting. Let NCP one. Let's change this to point seven. Apply. Okay. NCP two. Let's change this to point nine. Okay. NCP three change it to say point three apply okay okay finish the mass uh, let's select the other side select the 10 shade panel okay good finish the mass go to massing turn up show mass okay now you have a finished model thank you